Hi, welcome to another VividAquariums.com video. I'm Dave and today I'm going to talk to you about an age-old problem we've all experienced which is ugly, nasty bryopsis algae. This is a green kind of feathery looking algae. It will take over the rocks in the tank, a lot of times areas with high flow. Uh, it can be very hard to get rid of but there's some tricks we've learned throughout the years that can make it a lot easier for you. Now I've learned from uh, manufacturers themselves that uh, the Kent Marine Tech M as well as Continuum's Magnesium, these are both forms of magnesium but they're not such a pure form as you see in the Brightwell or the Salifert Magnesium or even Seachem Magnesium. And these two magnesiums from Tech M and the Continuum Magnesium actually as they're not as pure they contain traces of other heavy metals. Now exactly which heavy metals we don't know but these trace heavy metals in these two uh, brands of magnesium are very useful in getting rid of biopsis algae in a reef tank. We've used it in this tank behind me in our 800. We've used it throughout the store and they work beautifully to get rid of the algae. In a matter of two to three weeks you can have a tank infested with biopsis and turn it into a tank beautifully clean without a hint of it. Now these traces of heavy metals over time can become a problem so we recommend just using Tech M or to continue magnesium for a period of a month, maybe six weeks once you see the bryopsis melt away and you don't see any signs of it, I would recommend running some carbon, maybe even some cuprazord to help remove any of those excess heavy metals and then switch back your dosing to Brightwell or Seachem or the Salifert, uh, more of a pure magnesium. Now when you're trying to rid the tank of bryopsis, you want to raise the magnesium level high, as high as 14, 15 or even 1600 parts per million, but do this gradually over the course of a week to 10 days and then monitor your alkalinity and calcium levels as well. When you dose magnesium it tends to lower the alkalinity so you'll need to add extra buffer to the aquarium to maintain your alkalinity in the right range. And remember to keep an eye on your phosphates and nitrates as well because all these elements together when you keep the levels in line is going to help make it hard for any of that biopsis to grow back. So definitely it works. We've tested on many tanks throughout our store. It has great success. Tech M or Continuum's Magnesium can definitely help rid your tank of bryopsis, but use it as a short term. Again, once you see the tank rid of bryopsis, switch back to a more pure form of magnesium, and that's it. Finally, a way to get rid of that nasty bryopsis. Thanks, guys.